Hi, how's everybody doing today? This is Mike D and you're watching DIY Reptile Guy coming at you live. Alrighty, so let's kind of take a kind of a snack peek at some awesome cages that are going to be going up. I kind of want to do everybody's kind of take on this uh, whole thing. I know I'm still in the process of painting everything, just doing some flash coats to the top. This one's already pretty much done. Uh, I'm not going to show you guys the whole door thing. So these these two in particular. So both of these. This is a this is a four foot enclosure that was split down the middle, kind of. Um, and basically, this in here is 24 inches. This is 24 inches. I know uh, this doesn't really give it justice on the camera, as good as it looks in person. Uh, there's like right here. This is where some silicone spill, but that's not going to matter. Uh, because we're doing custom underfloor heating. Uh, this is actually the underneath of it, uh, while down here is going to be the top of it. This is actually the top. Um, so, yeah, you won't really even see that at all. And we're going to do custom LED lighting in all these enclosures with a bit of control off the touchscreen bed. It's going to be dope. It's going to be awesome. And I also got two in another room. I got two 48 inch, four foot enclosures and stuff. Then we're going to be putting some amazing, beautiful animals in um, so I can kind of display on the channel and stuff. And every single animal that I'm going to bring into the room and stuff, not only is it because I love working with them, I, I enjoy them and stuff at our other facility, but it's also because of, you know, I want it to be something that you guys can learn about. Um, you know, uh, uh, prime example, uh, just to kind of give you guys a little bit of a sneak peek into it and stuff. We are, uh, we're going to be getting some lance heads. So look forward to that. You know, all these are going to be hot cages. All these are arboreal pit viper cages and stuff. Um, and one of them is going to be a pit viper uh, as far as the 48 inch goes. Um, and I'm not going to kind of reveal, I'm not revealing any of the animals just yet. Just yet. Um, so, and, uh, you know, they'll be awesome. They'll, in the 148 inch, though, I do have a really cool lizard that I'm actually going to put in there. I'm going to put a pair of them in there. Uh, we might be able to get some breeding out of them. Um, I've only had a little bit of success with them, but we'll see, you know. Uh, just keep on staying tuned. Keep on watching. Keep on living the dream, everybody, as I'm living the dream over here, just living life, loving every day of it, uh, working with animals. I, I couldn't ask for anything greater, anything better, uh, you know. So anyway, so thank you so much for watching. I know I haven't been on here much. Uh, I just want to kind of share with you guys that I know the whole room's kind of a mess and a disaster right now. It's because I'm in the middle of a remod and my facility in town and, and all this other stuff going on. And I really don't have time to even deal with any of this stuff. But I'm trying to get this stuff up in my spare time like right now. I got a few minutes. I can work on it real quick. Kind of shoot a shoot a five minute video actually this is three minutes so anyways thank you so much for watching this is mike d and i'm out